All right, this one's for Granddad, and uh, Granddad's an old man, and I really, really enjoy his work on these uh, simple projects that you do uh, in the house, on a table, and not using very sophisticated equipment. And a lot of his work is done with that tool right there. It's a hot glue gun. That's the glue from it. And I just wanted to use this as a demonstration to show what's going on with this particular heat engine and the action is taking place right there at least on mine and what blade showed and what has happened here is the plastic material which is out of one of these coffee bags is being stressed and he shows it and now this is kind of what I'm seeing happen is when you take a pair of scissors and you curl on a ribbon by dragging it across it you stress one side of the material and the other side is, is relaxed and it curls. And right there at that tip, he shows in his video how to do that is you pull a sharp object along the back side of that material and it curls it just enough so it reacts to the heat um, more effectively. Now the material will react to the heat without doing that but when you stress it with that object there, a sharp object on the back side of it, you um, probably rearrange the molecular structure just enough so it reacts better to the heat at that one point. And uh, I think this is one of the uh, secrets of Blade's invention is that point right there that when heat is applied, it causes that whole arm member to deform and that's just enough to shift the center of gravity back and forth but anyway I'm having a lot of fun with this project and it all has to do with temperature differential and you need a temperature differential obviously to make this machine work but you can do it right there at that one point and I thought that was very interesting and this was for granddad uh, in his honor of using the hot glue gun and it's a wonderful tool for a lot of different projects and um, just wanted to share that. Thanks for watching.